So what we're going to show here is some nice, slick, very slick little units. Uh, these are what we call a CCTV box, or I call them an RJ45 splitter. Uh, they're great for guys that are installing security cameras. And uh, both of these here are the same unit. But I'm actually, I have one open here. So I'm going to show how it works. And I will show it, uh, you know, in more detail as well. Um, but um, for now, I'm going to zoom out a little bit here so you can see better. So we'll take it out of its packaging here. This one's already been opened. But uh, so basically what this is, it's a little box here. You can see it says CCTV box on it. And it's a weatherproof box for outside. Basically it would be mounted on the wall like so. And um, it's very slick. So it has this little tab here and you can pull this and you pull this guy out from inside. Now what's inside here is the magic fun part. So this is a brand new unit, so I'm going to take it out of its packaging here. So what this does, <clears throat> when you plug your main uh, camera feed into this yellow part, that's going to supply PoE. Now from one cable, you can run two cameras, and they're both going to be PoE. Uh, so I will show how that works later. And uh, it's a nice slick little unit, like I said. Uh, and the way this goes back in, this way. So your uplink wire goes into here. Your camera wires go into here. Your wires would come all out through here, through the bottom. And once it's mounted on a, a post or a wall, you just simply uh, push it up and in. And it would be out of the weather elements because it's all concealed inside the box. Very nice slick little unit. So we're going to show how this little PoE uh, splitter works here. So it comes uh, with this weatherproof box. We're going to take this out and put that aside for a moment. But uh, this is the inside of it. This piece here just comes right out. This is where you would put your uh, single PoE cable and here you can uh, tap off that and run uh, two cameras through one cable. You can also da daisy chain these uh, five or six times which is nice. So uh, let's show how this works. Uh, down here this white cable I actually have hooked up to a PoE switch on the floor here. So you can see uh, the cable is indeed running into that PoE switch there. So now what we're going to do, we're going to take this device and we're going to plug uh, the PoE uh, into here. Now when I do plug it in, you'll see both these ports will fire up and uh, it is uh, sending PoE there. So I have two cameras. I have a IPC3615 here I'm going to plug in first into uh, PoE uh, port number one. So we're going to plug that in here. Now when I plug this in, the IR light on the camera should light up. And I'll pull the camera in front of the lens here so you can see it. So that's camera one. Um, you can see the IR light there. It's hard to see in the camera. But the camera is powered up and on. Now you can also see data uh, going through on port one here. So we're going to go ahead and hook up a second camera. And the second camera, I'm going to plug into uh, port PoE port number two. And the second camera is our indoor uh, mini PTZ with built-in microphone. So when I plug this in, you'll hear it fire up because this one has a motor on it. So as you can see now, we're running two cameras through one PoE cable. And the way this would go back into this device here, uh, you can just pop this guy into here like so. And then your cables from the cameras, you're just going to bend them into that slot there. And then the main, the main feed here, which is uh, this guy here, uh, you're also just going to bend that over and bring it down the slot there. 
And then the cover is just going to slide on like so. And now it's in a nice weatherproof box. You would, uh, you know, screw that to a wall or uh, to a pole or uh, something. Anywhere where you need to run two uh, PoE powered cameras uh, through one cable. So beautiful little device there.